Hi guys, it is once again time for my project three uses. It's time to see if anything is leaving, what I thought about the items that were in here before. Uh, did I use everything? Well, if you want to know the answers to all of those, then stick around. Welcome or welcome back. If you're new here, my name is Andy. I'm really happy that you're here. Okay, you guys. Wow. Um, I did okay. I didn't do amazing, but I did okay. So in my last months, we're quickly go over it is the elf primer putty because I don't like it. Um, the Jade palette by beauty Bay, the chromosome highlighter is a very glowy highlighter. The keys liquid, not liquid cream blush. And the Natasha Denona Ayana palette. Now these were put in for different reasons. This and this were put in because I don't think I like it, but I wanted to like really concentrate on it and make sure. This and this is because I don't ever reach for them. I have used them. They were decent, but I hadn't reached for them. And then this I had never used and I never reached for. And I'm like, why? So those are why. So how did I do? How did I do? The e.l.f. primer putty. I used it three times. I actually used it more than that. I used it five times. Um, this is what it looks like. And I don't hate it as much as I thought I did. Okay, so I started using it with the putty brush. The e.l.f. putty brush. World of Difference world of difference. So I'm keeping it. The other thing, the Jade palette by Beauty Bay. You guys, this was amazing. I used this three times. And if you saw, if you saw my January my January palettes that I used, you'll, you would have seen three, three photos with my looks that I used. So I will link that up here up in the cards, up here in the cards. So if you're interested, you can go back and see my January palettes and what I used. But yes, as you can see, it's a little bit more used than last time, considering I hadn't used it at all. The shimmers are so, so nice. They're so nice. The mattes were nice. The mattes blended well. Um, they weren't patchy. They weren't dry. The, okay, so the thing that gives me pause about this whole thing is the way it's laid out. You guys, it doesn't make any sense. And I'm like, well, I can pop these out and redo them, you know, the way, a way that makes sense. You guys, I'm not doing that. I'm not, I don't, I'm not doing that. Um, and also, after I used it and realized how much I loved it, I was actually still thinking about passing it on, which is dumb. It's dumb because this is a beautiful formula. Now I know why people love Beauty Bay so much. I did not have a very good first impression of Beauty Bay. It was terrible for me. I had a, I had a good sex, second impression, which was the midnight palette that Ash had given me. And, um, so this I got from a mystery box. I was just like, mm, no, it's really nice. Definitely keeping, definitely keeping. So both things that I actually met my goal, uh, I'm keeping them both because I realize I do like them. Now the three things I didn't meet my goal. I used this zero times. I used this zero times. Zero. I mean, it's, it's really only been used like one time, maybe twice, maybe twice. So I didn't use those at all. And this I used one time. So I'm going to keep them in the project because I have to use them three times. And CC, CC from Panning for Goals and also CC's Trial Says Life, um, we're kind of doing this parallel to each other. She decided to do this. She invited me to join her. Of course, I said yes. This sounds like such a great, great thing. Um, so, uh, I've got, I got to use this two more times, you guys. Okay. The problem I have with this, the formula is beautiful. The shades are beautiful. It's like a one hit wonder. 
I only, I do the same look as I did the last time I used it. Like I actually ended up using a ColourPop single with this and I liked it a lot. So I'm probably going to keep it, but I am still going to use it twice. And I'm going to keep the picture that I had from my January palettes and see if the look, the look looks the same. I mean, it kind of has to, it kind of has to, you guys. It's like transition, crease, outer corner, lid, and then this. I don't even know. I don't, I don't really care for that shade right there. All right. So those three things are, are staying in. But anyway, what Cece was doing in her, um, she's calling hers third, third time's a charm. And um, I'm calling mine what's on the chopping block. They're on the chopping block. Um, she is keeping hers in. If she doesn't meet her goal, she's keeping hers in. But if she doesn't reach her goal in three months, then she's just decluttering it. Because if she hasn't used it in three months, three times in three months, then it's not going to be worth keeping. It, she says it's not, it's not worth it. And I agree. So I'm going to do that. So these guys have two more months or else they're out. All right. So, so I finished two things. So it means I have to roll two things in. Well, when I did my, I rated my ColourPop palettes, you guys, and there were some that I didn't care for, but I don't really know if I cared for them. I didn't like the color story. Um, the one I just hadn't used. So these are coming in. This is the Anna Whimsy. This was my second to last palette that I had. I don't know if I like that. You guys, I don't, I don't like the color story, but I haven't really used it much. So, I mean, I've used it, but not much. So I'm going to use that three times and see if I can come up with three different looks for it. And then the other one is the Baroque palette. Such a pretty palette. It's very dark. It's very kind of the same tone. So I need to see if I can create different looks with this and maybe use it as a companion palette, but I don't like using things as companion palettes. If I can't use it for a whole look, I usually won't use it. I just won't. Um, and I know me and I won't. So those are my items for my project three uses. They're on the chopping block. Tell me what you think in the comments below. Um, to, if you have, if you, I know a lot of people love this putty primer. They do. And I, now I'm kind of getting it. I'm kind of getting it. I'm still not loving. I don't love it, but I like it. Yeah, I like it. Um, it's going to take a while for me to love it. So if you're having problems with this e.l.f. primer, try using either the putty brushes, one of the putty brushes from e.l.f. They're very inexpensive. Or use something that is, is very dense and flat. Yeah, try that out and see what happens. What are you doing? Come here. You guys, Luna's visiting. Luna is visiting us. If you haven't seen Luna, Luna is my grand dog. And her mama is asleep in the next room. And um, yeah, she's visiting for the night. So I love having her here. She's very fun. And she's very sweet. And look at that face. You guys, look at that face. How do you not love that face? She's a little bat dog. She, she looks like a bat. All right, you guys. Tell me. Tell me what you think. Uh, are you ashamed? Are you ashamed of me? For not using all of these items? Tell me in the comments below. And tell me what you think of my products. If you haven't already, go over and check out Cece from uh, Panning for Goals. She also has Cece's Trial Size Life. If you like to watch unboxings and makeup related content, go over there. If you like to watch panning, you guys, my hair is a mess. If you, guys, if you like to watch panning, then check out Panning for Goals. I will have both linked in the description box below. And thank you guys so much for being here. I really appreciate you. And until our next adventure, everyone have a great day and we'll see you later.